So this month we had the amazing privilege of hosting the Planetary Crisis Summit for our FPMT European family. So we invited leaders of the various centers across Europe to join us for two days of deep conversation on the topic of the planetary crisis. And the purpose of the summit was to create a space where we would get together to explore together what it means to be a Dharma center at this time of crisis and how it is that the FPMT could mobilize and support their communities in the context of the planetary crisis. This is the matter of survival of the whole human race and the whole system of life on Earth. We, you know, it's, it's such a vast question, that's one reason why um, that can, it can be difficult to talk about. When we come together um, and we bring up our fears, our concerns, our hopes, a lot of energy comes, inspiration, courage also, and a recognition that there is a, a lot that we can offer and there's a deep sense of responsibility that we have as community to enter the public square. It's all our ignorance, our greed, our attachment, and the Dharma, which we're already practicing, has the solutions. So if we can get this out into the world, then we have the main tools to deal with this, all this crisis, humanitarian crisis, ecological crisis, and, and so on. The crises that are happening all around are crisis of the mind. So for me, working for the environment, in, it's a way to put in act the profound teachings about compassion and interdependence. In preparation for the summit, we turned to some of our lamas, and especially His Holiness the Dalai Lama, Sir Konsemcha Rinpoche, His Eminence Ling Rinpoche, and they offered us um, video footage encouragement and words of guidance and wisdom. And one of the things that was very prevalent when we watched together as a community this, this feedback was that our lamas are turning to us and they are not just encouraging us but really waiting for us to step forward and to help them to get the message across in, in connection with the planetary crisis. So I think that was a, a real strong message that came out. So I feel I can do something now. Um, and I feel this because I feel supported. I feel supported by our teachers. I feel supported by so many other parts of our organization, which includes the FPMT as, as a whole and I think this is so important because we have this amazing organization and we have so many people that we actually can make an impact and and by connecting and by seeing that other people feel the same want the same and are also struggling how to make this work um, this gives me hope it gives me energy and it gives me empowerment it was very helpful to connect with people and creating some momentum and I think it's kind of a historic event in the FPMT, I think. Lots of people are doing things but in isolation from each other. So when we bring them all together it can create a massive culture change. And I'm feeling confident that there's going to be a gradual transformation, not of the essence of the teaching. You don't throw out the baby with the bathwater. But what you need to do sometimes is clean out the bathwater and bring in fresh water. And I think that what we're doing here is actually putting in some fresh water.